hello guys welcome back to my channel boost my brain so today we will start with a new poem and that is heart of a tree so first let us know a little bit more about the poet who is henry curler bunner he was an american novelist a poet and a journalist and he is known for his other work like tower of babel so heart of a tree is a motivational poem the poet asks the question that what does he do who plants a tree so if you plant a tree what effect will it have he answers the question himself that when a plant grows it goes up to the sky they are like friends so sun and sky are his friends so the next line talks about he plants the flag of breezes free the shaft of beauty towering high so it means that the branches of the tree sway due to the air or the wind just like a flag so when you are planting a tree you are even making a house for the birds those who come and stay. so the birds they make a house on the tree and then when we sleep we can hear the birds singing so he says that all these things are the work which you do when you plant a tree again the poet asks what does he do when who plants a tree so tree again gives shade from the sun so tree brings rain and tree gives less heat so the people can take shelter birds can sing and they make the tree their home the seeds which you plant will turn to buds they will slowly grow and even if we are not alive in the coming years then the seeds will grow into a tree for our future generation so if you plant now then if the next generation can take the fruits from those tree so one who plants the glory of pain he plants the forest heritage so when he is planting one tree the tree will produce some seeds and again that seed will turn into a tree so in this way he can make a forest planting by just one tree the next line the joy that on born i shall see these things he plants who plant a tree so here the poet means to say that uh, one tree can turn into forest and here the babies who are unborn they can still take the benefit even after we are no more in this world so when do you, when you make a house you make a home you form a community you have neighbors and then from there you there will be connection with the town then city and then again the state so one who plants a sapling it turns into leaf then the tree produces wood and then you make a house so when you make a house you start living inside the house so that is home for you when you are staying in that particular home you have different houses nearby so there you will form so here you form a community and community will turn into town then city then state and finally into country so in this way society will start living together so that is what the poet talks about the civic good and one who creates a tree is very powerful he'll think of so he is thinking of future and one who thinks of future and for the welfare of other people then he is very powerful he is very broad minded and he is the one who wants to connect with the world so the poem ends here i hope you all loved the video please do like comment share and subscribe and and see you all in my next video